is the youngest bishop in the Anglican Church today. He's Bishop John Orina Omangi. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank Karibu you. sana, Bishop. Asante sana. Wow. Did you always know you had a calling to be a bishop, to serve in the church? Honestly, I didn't know that I had a calling. Uh, only that when I was in primary school, uh, my fellow pupils used to call me pastor. And uh, this name, I really rejected it from onset. Yes. But you didn't know it was a I prophecy? I didn't know that yeah, it will turn out to be where I am now. If you could uh, quickly tell us, why do they call you the youngest bishop? What is the requirement? According to the Anglican tradition and constitution in Kenya, those who become bishops must have attained the age of 35. But historically, we have never had a bishop consecrated at the age of 35. Mm -hmm. I am the first one to be consecrated at that age in the Anglican Church of Kenya. This is the time for the youth and the church is sending out a message that the youth should uh, take up responsibility in the church and everywhere. What are some of the challenges that you went through when you were pursuing education? In fighting of the parents because of drinking, family challenges, sometimes we could go angry. In fighting of parents will make us sleep outside. No, I finished my standard eight, then uh, I was called to schools uh, after scoring uh, uh, 396. We were doing seven subjects by then, but uh, when I took the letters to the parents that have been uh, called uh, to these schools, they told me that they are not able. Were you satisfied with mm -hmm. that answer? I decided to move away from church, from home to church. And we thank God for those whom I found at the church, especially the pastors who were staying there, who accommodated me. I became their houseboy. I decided uh, to negotiate with the head teacher to allow me to come to school at, uh, at uh, 8, 8, 8 a.m. and leave at uh, around 4. So they have to get back and work and get some money so that I'll pay us uh, school fees. Uh, because uh, I didn't see an option of getting money. I remember even uh, asking uh, one of the uncles around to help me with something, but they refused. Uh, but we thank God for that. It uh, helped me to run to God. You're a high school kid. What exactly would you do to be uh, able to make money to pay for your school fees? Some of the things I used to do is uh, one is digging in people's shamba. Uh, I could uh, go to people's shamba and uh, ask for, I can work for you, I can dig this mm -hmm. shamba. So I could be given a contract of uh, digging somebody's uh, farm. For me, for lunch, I used to pesk on the sun uh, for all the time. Uh, sometimes I have 10 bob or 5 shillings, I could go and buy sugarcane, I do. Sugar cane. Then uh, after lunch, we get into the class. We continue with our studies. For four years? For four years. All those four years were difficult for me. How would you encourage parents or family that mm. are struggling to pay school fees for their, for their children? A parent should not leave his or her children in a respite. Let them try to support those children because uh, the many disappointments which you are seeing now is a result of some parents who failed somewhere along the line. How about mm. the students that, mm. uh, that don't want to, even if their education is free, they still mm. don't want to pursue it? Do they have an excuse? Don't divert the left or right focus on your education and uh, it will protect you. It will make your name great. Yeah, it will open doors for you. And those who have no but to support them, mm. that's not the end. You can rise beyond your limitation. I refuse to not to be imprisoned, my mind to be imprisoned by what uh, my people told me that they we cannot be able to take you to school. I refuse to be imprisoned. So don't accept to be imprisoned in your mind. There is a big thing ahead of you. Take the first step and the next door will be opened for you. Determination, courage and focus has come in handy for Bishop John Orina. He can do it, you can do it. 
Beyond the Limit show is here to remind you that you have everything that all great men have. That's all we have for today. Thank you so much, Thank Bishop. You. Thank, Thank you, you for coming. Thank you. Asante.